Hello everyone, it's the Upform team over here and today we're going to show you guys how you can start using SurveyMonkey to better create your forms. Specifically, we're going to go into how you can start changing and messing around with your survey title. So in this video, we're only going to go into specifics of how you can change your survey title, meaning this is the title that your respondents and you yourself can see. So first things first, let's choose the survey that we want to change the title of. In this case, we're going to change the title for the customer feedback for our shop. So once you've opened the corresponding survey, it's going to bring you right here to the summary page. Now, here you can't really do much in regards to the design, so you're going to want to head over to the design survey page, which is on, on the right hand side of the summary button over here. So once you've hit design survey, It'll bring you to this page where you can now start messing around with the contents, buttons, and questions that are currently on your form. And what you're going to want to do is head over to where you can see the title of your form and then you're going to want to hit edit. So here now you can start editing with your survey title. You can even mess around with the alignment and the category. In this case, I am going to change the title a bit because I wanted to say our brand stores multiple because i am now using this form for multiple stores not just one additionally just take note that you can also mess around with a rich text editor so that you can bold it underline it italicize it or even change the text color as needed in this case i am just going to bold it and then maybe i can mess around with the text color so if you hit this little triangle button beside the a you can now mess around with what color you can use for the text survey monkey provides a variety over here that you can choose from in this case i am going to go with a green okay another thing we want you to take note of when it comes to editing your survey title is that you can use a nickname so if you were to tick this box over here you will see that you can provide an alternative name for this survey that none of your respondents will see, but only you and other editors of this form can see. Now, this is really great for when you might have the same survey title for multiple surveys, but they might be referring to different surveys on your database. So let's say I have multiple of our branches. I can say that this is the general form, all stores. So it's not just... Um, referring to a specific store this is actually referring to the overall brand in general so that's our nickname for now and once you're happy with this and you even checked the alignment if you want it to be centered maybe i'll keep it center and you can change the category in case the contents of your questions change you're happy with everything you can just hit save over here and voila so the so the title here changes and on the upper left side where you saw the initial survey title it's going to change into your nickname seeing as this is what the customer sees in this case so customer feed for our brand stores but this is what you're going to see when you start referring to this form so let's just preview this so you get a better idea of how this will look like and as you can see the ch changes were made and if you were to head back to dashboard our new title is the nickname not the generic title and that's all we really have to say about this. Hopefully this helps you better manage any data collection you might be doing. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Be sure to like and subscribe. If you need any more help when it comes to SurveyMonkey, be sure to check out the rest of our channel using either the link on the upper right corner of this video or any of the links below. See you next time!